Well, folks, look at that. I finally got my Diamond Northern Pike. Watched more videos this morning, two of them. And one kid said to try here, and I did. And uh, he told what time of day and what he used. And on my 10th cast, I got him. See, look at him. Isn't he cool? <laughs> See? Oh, there he is. <laughs> here. There you go. <laughs> yeah, there he is. Diamond Northern Pike. Right there. I'll show you what I used for him real quick. Boink. Uh, yep, let's let him go. He scored 79.22. Mm-hmm. 51 degrees Fahrenheit. 25.31 pounds and almost 4 feet long. Excellent. Excellent. Uh, so let's let him go. Goodbye, fish. And... I used my bait casting rod. I got it set up now. I got this, whatever it is, Grarier bait casting. Strength 110.23 pounds. Line strength 55 pounds. Heavy, fast action. I still got the Balak, 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 Kaksa. I still got this reel. <laughs> I'm using 55 pound line. And I used a 2 aught popper, topwater popper, fishing in the earliest morning hours. I got here as fast as I could. I had to stop and buy this. And I came straight out here. Uh, the map, oddly enough, I'm right here. I'm over here. I had this spot marked. It was incorrect. It's here. So I need to take this mark off. And right here... I need to put that marker there. This is where he's at. So I was close, but no cigar. Uh, I'm going to label this Northern Pike. And there you go. So, see this is another spot somebody caught one I've been trying at. And I never caught him. Uh, that other mark that was up here was uh, from um, Discord. One of the known hot spots. This is another one. But he was over here on this side. See, I actually passed it thinking it was this cove. If you walk it right here, this cove, it's all full of these lily pads. Um, home base is right here, right up this road here. Just fast travel to this guy's what I did. Grabbed a car. So you can grab a car right here. I grabbed a car and simply drove down this road, jumped out. It is only 6.33 in the morning. I started fishing. Uh, well, I got to the tackle shop at 6.01. Needless to say, I got here real quick. Ten cast. Not expecting anything. Bang. And I went, holy shit. And I thought for a second, thought, you're using a two-watt hook. This is him. It was. And I caught him in uh, two minutes, 46 seconds. <laughs> With this heavy-ass line. So there he is. It looks really cool. It's all lily pads, folks. All of this cove. How to find right where I'm at? There's this little cluster of rocks. And there's sticks. Like somebody had a campfire here at one time. My Jeep is over the hill over there. But the road... Put this away. You're scaring the children. See, my Jeep's over there. If you drive too far, if you go past this sign here, you're too far. If tired, stop and rest. See? So I went to this cove. If you see this cove, it's not the right one. I was over here. And this is one of the marked known spots for the Diamond Northern Pike. But he wasn't here. Goldstein can show up right over there. But this, not enough lily pads. I thought, this doesn't look right. So I ran down this ways. Like this right, y'all. Oh, and Father Jack, thank you so much for the information, brother. Uh, I do believe I have the ranger and that screaming bitch shut off. They can't talk. <laughs> but it's this one. And I came running along here. And you can't miss it. 
like I said, uh, you can miss it. I ran past it, I think. Yeah, this little cove right here. This is where I was fishing. See, there's that stick. I came right down here. Sticks and stones all over right here. And this general shape. They're just kind of by themselves, as you can see. Right here. Sticks and stones came down to the water's edge. And he came from that direction. Straight out. But I cast it around here. Cast it around over there. Reference here. See, there's the corner over there. With the big rock. Come around the bank right here. And it's this little spot. This little patch right. Cha. That's where I'm at. And I cast it out like 100 yards. As far as I could throw just about all around through here a couple of times. And he nailed it right out straight out there. So there you go. There is the mystery of the Diamond Northern Pike solved right there, sir. Right there. Around this little corner, big rocks, little clearing of rocks right here just before you go around. Straight out. And that's him. So, sorry I couldn't record. I did figure I'd go to do another two-hour recording today. I didn't count on catching this bastard right off the bat. So, anyways, hope this helps anybody. Let me know if it did. And uh, give it a try. I couldn't believe it. This guy said, I highly recommend trying here. And I did. And right off of the bat, 10 cast. Uh, and bang. <laughs> so, there you go. Until next time, folks, you guys know what to do. Keep on fishing and peace out, people. Just peace out.